Do your best to present yourself to God as one approved, a worker who has no need to be ashamed, rightly handling the word of truth. So just like seeking the truth, we'll be analyzing the market using technical indicators to determine the trend direction. In this video, we'll be going over the RSI. The Relative Trend Index is a technical indicator used in the analysis of financial markets. It is intended to chart current and historical strength or weaknesses in the market based on closing prices of recent trading periods. So as you see on this image here, we can see how price is moving. When price reaches overbought, then it starts to come down. Just like it came all the way down to oversold, it turns up and it goes up. So now let's get onto the platform and see how to use this technical indicator. On your platform, under the list of indicators, if you go all the way down, as it's sorted by uh, in alphabetical order, you find the RSI. You can drag it to the chart or simply double click on it. And these are the common use uh, levels that is provided. Uh, right now, I'm gonna go ahead and add two more. I'm gonna put 40 and also add 60. And then once you're done with the levels, just click on OK. And then you should see the RSI on your chart. So this is where you will see how price is moving in the market uh, in regard to this pair, GBP USD. And as you can see, the market kept going down. As you can see, the candle as the line keep going down. And it went all the way past the level that we set for uh, oversold and now when it cross up then it start to go back up as you can see also the candle I added the 40 and uh, 60 at that level you can see there's no trend as you can see right here the market is moving in sideways and again you can see the RSI also moving in sideways but gradually it's still going up a little bit so uh, as you can see, the RSI is showing you when price is overbought right here and it's getting ready to come down. As you can see the candle, it crawls the overbought and it's coming down. Uh, let's find uh, another example. All right, so let's see right here as well. We can see price went above the uh, our level for overbought and it came down a little bit. And then it went back up and then uh, as you can see it's going down so is the candles as you see here similarly you can see here the price went all the way down as you can see on the R RSI so when do you get in you get in when the RSI crosses below not when the first cross up when it crosses down not when the first cross up so you wait for it to start going down on the level where you have it set. Uh, trading with RSI, you also need to be ready to, if you don't have any kind of confirmation, another indicator to check, you probably, uh, it could turn into a long-term trade. As you can see here, price went into overbought and it came down and you probably will enter into a trade uh, thinking that it's gonna go down for a sale and as you can see, even though it's showing like it's going down, actually the price is actually going up. While it's doing that, it went all the way down, but as you can see, price is still going up. So uh, you need another confirmation while you, if you're using this alone, sometimes it can turn it into a long-term trade. So be ready for it if you're just using the RSI. And sometimes it will just work like a cross, uh, the cross up going up and then as you can see, price is going up. It crawls down, going down. As you can see, price is coming back down. So this is how you use the RSI. And uh, there are also tools that you can use to get notification instead of waiting for this to happen. Depending on the time frame, it could take forever. We also have technical indicator called multi indicator here that you can use. Uh, so just go ahead and double click it and I'm gonna go ahead and select the strategy which is RSI that we're using and I'm gonna find RSI and see the set levels so 
our side and the level is 30 70 just like the way I want it to be and then I'm gonna go ahead and click OK so as you can see here when price went above it and it's getting ready to come down you will get a notification right there when it crossed below the set line 70 it went back up and it came in across so you will get notified each time uh, it crosses cross going down after the candle closed and you get notification it went all the way below the 30 and it started going up so you get notified when it cross so you can jump in the trade again same here you get notified so instead of watching for this to take place so this from this line to here is a whole day so you can't wait around you get notification if this is your strategy and this indicator also comes with support and resistance so you can know exactly where the trend is going so as you can see uh, it came down to the support as we talked about in the previous video it came down to the support and it tried to go and it keep hitting the support and you already got a buy signal from the RSI so you're looking for a buy and it's going up and now it went to a so again it touched the uh, resistance so it's going to push it down as you can see the RSI you get notification saying it's getting ready to go down and as you can see price started to go down so this is one way that you can trade using the RSI like I said, just using the RSI alone, you will have to be prepared uh, for some time it could be a long term trade. And again, remember when price is moving between about 40 and 60, it's moving sideways, as you can see here. You can find some different spot. It, again, it's not trending, it's going sideways, sideways. And then you can see it went down to the oversold and the cross up and the shoot up and it's going up so you can buy it right there and every time with the indicator the cross is going down you get notification you get notification you get notification the cross below going up you get a buy so you be ready for look for a buy opportunity in the market so this is how you use the RSI so I'll go ahead and take this one off and show you one more. Uh, just delete this from, from there. We also offer the multi-level RSI scanner. So I can put this on there. This uh, allow you to look at uh, many time frames at the same time. So all you, you got to do is just make sure you enter the pairs as you see here and it will show up. So uh, we got GBP USD. So let me take some of these out. Uh, just type in, and so you can put G G G P U S D comma Euro U S D comma, and then uh, A U D U S D dot B A R. I'll add one more. I just put minus one hundred. And once you have all of the values that you want to scan, go ahead and click OK. And what this does is going, it's showing you the RSI level, and it's showing you each time frame. Uh, if you're just using this, you have to switch to see what's going on each time frame. But with this one, it will show you exactly what's going on in each time frame, so you'll be ready, and you'll get notified. So uh, this is a. Uh, a pretty neat tool to help you especially if you're trading with the RSI. So I'll see you in the next video.